Morning, guys. These are the ones from the uh, Chicken Hotel that um, I think it was 13 or 11 of them we had. We gave some to Stu. Looking bloody good, aren't they? Little young fellas going in the pot soon. They all sleep in the tree here now because the tractor's over there protecting the turkeys. So welcome all to an Aussie farming in the Philippines. Hope you had a great day, a great weekend. I've still got the snivels up. Fuck my dog, I tell you. YouTube guidelines, they're saying you've got to stop saying all them fuck words all the time. Well, FMD guys, I tell you, FMD. So I get um, I get lots of complaints come through on it all. I just uh, go, flock off. You know? Why so many of you out? Hey, what the fuck's going on? Right, update. Right. Our precious little girlfriend. Yes, here she is. Precious, gorgeous. Here you go. Oh! So, she had the artificial insemin done on her the other day. Now, I didn't video it because I shared a, I shared a loving around with Chick Chick, so um, it's on her videos. I'll leave a link up on the top up here, 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 fucking wherever. And, um, We'll go through what they do in the Philippines for AI, so you've got an idea on what happens. So um, she was actually quite quite calm, apparently, for what she told me. Sort of like um, she wanted to mate with the guys that gave it to her, actually. And I'm like, oh well, you know, you're going to stick that bloody long thing up me, I tell you. But um, she ended up going for the. They ended up bringing back the big white um, sperm. They said they got big whites, two of them there. So I was like, okay. No problem. So as long as she's mated, I don't care what it is with. You know, as long as it's not with those trolls. Do you know what I mean, Stacey? Don't want you slipping in the back door with Van. I don't want that happening. But um, I can't wash her down for three days. So she's a little bit dirty, I'm afraid, at the moment. My gay girlfriend. Hey. Right, so she's going okay. So that's our piggy update. So I'll leave a link, like I said, behind. Behind. Fucking knows. So I'll leave a link there. Go and have a look at Chick Chick's channel and you'll see how they do it in the Philippines. It's different from um, other places. And I'm curious because I always wonder how they collect it. Like I've seen how they do it for horses, how they do it for cows and all that stuff. But um, imagine what they do here in the Philippines. Ooh. Well, Bob's van's gone. So Bob left this morning. So um, thank you very much, Bob. And um, lots of good comments for Bobby. He's a really nice guy, he really is. And like he says, um, if I can come out and give you a hand, he says, help a mate out, he says, I'll definitely do it. So we got the Panabo block done and we got all that back creek area done from the flood. So uh, very good, Bob. I think a lot of skills in that man, I'll tell you. A lot of skills. And thing is, don't be afraid to use it. You know, don't be afraid to use it. Hello. Hello. Is that you, one eye? No? Is that you? Give me a look. Come here. Come here, come here, come here, come here, come here. Come here. Oh, yeah. Okay. Come on. There you go. Right, that's one eye out. Oh, his eye's getting better. I can hardly tell if it's him or not. But when he's out in the daylight, you can see. Yeah. It's coming, big boy. It's coming. Right, so payday today, pension day, yeah! So I love pension day, because I've been receiving a pension as, as a, um, what, what did them trolls call it? A, um, a government welfare bum. I like that, bum. A government welfare bum. So I've been receiving a pension since I was 40 years old. And uh, that's the thing, when, if you, you do 20 years military service, then you retire in my days, it was on DFRDB. And that way you get a lump sum of X amount, plus you also get a pension of X amount till the day you die, and then your wife gets five eighths of that when when you die, and she gets that until the day she dies. And if you've got any kids, you get one eighth of that up until they're 18 or finish schooling, whatever. So um, I said, people say to me, oh yeah, well, even, even when I was fire chief working over in the Middle East, I was still picking up the Australian pension, and people say, yeah, you're going to lose your fucking pension. You're going to lose it because you're not living in Australia, mate. Huh? Huh? Well, I'm afraid you don't with DFRDB. And even when I die, um, it goes to Chick and it gets paid to Chick in the Philippines. Yeah. Fucking knows. I was all right when I woke up. And then it was like... 
Maybe I'm allergic to the daylight or something like that, you know? Don't know. Don't know. Well, today's going to be a rest day because Bob worked the hell out of me the last two days. My guts are sore as hell. You know, bending down all the time, doing all those tying up and, you know, just bloody work, Bob. I tell you, you're killing me, you bastard. You're killing me. So Bob's gone home, so I'm going to have a rest day today. Today's Thursday because Friday I've got a lot to do. Saturday, Chick Chick's going to the funeral. We were going to go there together on Saturday, only we were going to get Alfredo to, um, Alfredo, Wilfredo, to look after the farm when we go there. But um, he, Chick went and seen him yesterday again, and they said, oh, his mother, who's an old granny as well, like old granny as well, she's not too well, and they've got to go and pick her up. So um, he said, sorry, I can't do it now. I'd love to, you know, but my, my mother's now very sick so we said no problem so I'm going to look after the farm on Saturday and Chick's going to get um, the cousins or Papa and uh, Papa wants to take the truck because what they do Philippines in funerals is they they pick up the body fucking knows they pick up the body and they go to the cemetery where they're going to put it in the ground and have a big procession they're all on their motorbikes and cars and their trucks with thousands of people hanging off like fucking step toe and son you know and they're all um going down to the funeral then they put granny in the ground and you know you all drive back again to the house so papa wants to take the truck so he could take a load of uh, hooligans with him in the truck but um i don't know how that's going to go so they're um and are at the moment so chick's working it out with papa maybe she'll go with her cousins maybe she'll go with them but i'll spend the day looking after the um farm so that she can relax with the family and say well the farm's looked after just take it easy just take it easy taking it easy right it's going to be a lovely day guys so i'm going to go in get the animals prepared then breakfast time what a great day so isn't that good news on miss piggy guys i hope it works they said sometimes it doesn't work on the first time a girl's been you know she's come to age and she's been humped you know, once she's a virgin and she's been humped, it's sort of sometimes it doesn't work. But if they come back again in X amount of days later when she comes on heat again, you see, they'd see that it always works. They've all had 100% um, work. So it just must be that virgin shock. You know, it's like, oh, I'm a virgin. Ooh. So there you go. Let's see what happens. So, but anyway, I guarantee you that uh, in six months' time, we'll be back into making bacon again. We'll have the smoker going. We'll be making roast, making sausages, making patties, and that yummy, crispy, thick bacon. Definitely be happening in a few months' time, guys. Guarantee it. All right, love you and leave you. Remember, hit the like button, hit the subscribe button, okay? Get all them algorithms fucked up with YouTube, you know, and all those trolls. We'll be all sitting there going, all oh, that pass. He's only got 3,000 subs and he's got as much views as the fat farming, fat farling hog. Bastard, he's got to be buying them. Bastard. All right. What a great day. Look at that sunshine. God, it was hot out there yesterday. Goat herding. Why do I goat hurt? Because I don't want anyone stealing the goats. Do they steal goats? Yes, they steal fucking everything here. So three times I've had people come up to the goats when they haven't seen me. Then they've seen me and done a quick... You turn and out of there. So yes, you gotta you gotta look after him. But it's bloody hot out there. Not to worry. All right, guys. Love you and leave you. TTFN. Hit the subscribe. Hit the like. Hit the comments. Put a comment down below what you think about Miss Piggy. See you later, guys. Bye bye.